and I, I booked this movie hearts in atlantis right and i'm i completely forgotten about this precision driving stuff right i booked this movie hearts in atlantis and mickey g was the uh, it started anthony hopkins uh-huh. and uh and anton yelchin who yeah um, that dude is a badass yeah who we won't who we will just leave at that right because yeah, that yeah. i knew him when he was that age yeah and I can't let my heart get hurt talking about that right yeah, now. Yeah, you know what I mean? But yeah. yeah. Um, so I'm working with this kid who's genius and this man who's genius. And Mickey G. Canoza, I'm playing the low man in it. The low man, the kind of scary, lurky, shadowy, evil figure. Right? And uh, Mickey comes over and he's like, hey, Burke, uh, I, I knew you did stunts, but you're a precision driver? And I go, yeah, yeah. He goes, I know. I called. I, I saw you registered. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, okay, cool. Well, I'm going to have you drive this thing, man, because we're going to, this is actually perfect because I thought I was going to have to figure out, we were just figuring out how we were going to shoot it uh, and not pick you up. You know, I'd use one of my guys, flying one of my guys and, and not pick you up. But since, you know, since you, you're you certified, yeah, we'll have you do it. I was like, that sounds fucking great, man. He's like, yeah, yeah, that saves us, saves the day here, man. Now, the problem is here's where being a foster kid comes back, right? Because I'm like, I saved the day perfect this is the best except the shot was in an alleyway a pedestrian t alleyway cobblestone making rain in a 1958 oldsmobile with a camera move on a dolly with making rain and a pass with a right hard right turn with anthony hopkins sitting in the back you gotta be kidding me I almost shit my pants when they were explaining it to Holy me. Shit. Even now, you might even, I can feel the color. I swear to God, I can feel the color rushing from my face. You could probably yeah, see it. Yeah. I mean, that genuinely, it makes me sick to my stomach because I'm, I'm psychosomatically thinking back to when they were telling me and I can feel the, I can feel the blood rushing from my face right now That's crazy. because I thought I was going to die when they were telling me, but I had saved the day, right? So foster kid kicks in and instead of being like, Hey, can we just, you know, speaking up and advocating for myself and being like, Hey man, I'm scared to shit to do that. Instead, I was like, yeah, man, yeah, I got it. I think that's like what a lot of people do on set. 100%. You just always say yes, even yep. if you, yeah, man. you just kind of figure it out. You know, and and that, I mean, that that I'm on board with that because that is a part of where you're going to get your best out of you, right? And if no one's at risk of getting hurt, I'm for it, right? And no one was really at risk of getting hurt in this because I was. Hopkins. Well, no, I mean, I we it was a slow speed. I, I mean, it was speed. it was slow speed. It was like 12, 14 miles an hour. But I mean, um, the car, you know, things like that. But I was a precision driver. So like, if you really don't lie on your resume, yeah. don't say you're a precision driver without having gone to Bondurant. Say you can drive manual. Don't say you've got a CDL if you don't have a CDL. Yeah. Because if they get you to set day, you know, if, if on the day, you're there and they're like, that's when that form is going to come out. Or they're like, cool, I just need to write down your CDL number for the insurance or whatever. And now you're the one that fucked that production. So what I had to remember, I told Mickey quietly after Scott Hicks, the director, everybody's there and I'm saying I can do this. They're telling me what it is. And I'd already said I could do it. And now they're telling me really what it is. And I'm like, holy shit, I don't know. If, and so Mickey, to his credit, I walked over with Mickey. He was like, hey, man, um, I'm going to die, I think, right now. Like, I feel like I'm going to pass out. And he goes, yeah, I, I would feel that way too, man. I would feel that way too. And you know what the, the important thing to remember is? I go, What's that? He goes, you actually know how to do this. Like, actors, man. We have this imposter syndrome that runs through oh, us, right? Oh, for sure, yeah, totally. I'm like, I can't really, I'm not really That's that. a good director right there. Yep. He to was our stunt coordinator. Back. Yeah, he brought me right back to it. He goes, yeah. all you got to remember is you actually can do this. Like, yeah. you, I have proof. Like, you have receipts. You can do this. This really isn't change out 1956 Oldsmobile for 2000. I think it was 2001. Where, you know, for a brand new whatever. I mean, yeah. just you can do this and I'm here with you and we're going to run it until you get it. Was Anthony Hopkins nervous? He was fucking amazing. No, he was the best, man.